Okay, welcome to Friday Writing. So if you are watching this video, it means you're done drafting your story. If you're not done drafting your story, I need you to pause the video and go work on your story and come back to this. So this is going to be just, I'm basically going to read you a list. And what I want you to do before you come in Tuesday is I want you to do some very basic editing before we publish these. I'm not going to ask you to do anything that's tricky, like any sort of grammar that I haven't taught you, none of that. Just some very, very basic things that a fifth grader should be able to do, that there shouldn't be excuses for. And it's nothing I haven't, like, that I would need to teach you. So the PM pod, you have this paper, so take it out. The AM pod, you're going to need to do this on the computer, okay? So here's a checklist. And it, I'm going to read it, but it's pretty simple. Did I reread what I wrote? If when you do this checklist, you've reread it, you just check yes. If not, you click no and then reread it. So you can click correct it. Did I use capital letters at the start of a sentence? So you need to check, did you use capital letters at the start of every single sentence? If so, yes. If no, put no and then correct it and check correct it. Did I use capital letters for proper nouns? Well, that's pretty simple. It's just names. Did I use capital letters for names? I'll write names in here, okay? Did I use periods or other punctuation at the end of my sentences? So do the end of my sentences have periods or punctuation? Next, do I spell basic words correctly? So if you use really complicated things, fine. Have mistakes, it's okay. But basic things like school or because, Words you've been writing with for years, get them right, okay? Here's one that maybe you haven't always done. Did I put two spaces after each period? So when the sentence is over, you can't start the next one. You have to put two spaces. And then finally, do my sentences make sense? Okay, just ask yourself, does this make sense? And check them. All right. Um, so let me quickly show you this at work. Sorry about that. Okay, so I have this little draft of a paragraph a kid wrote me like a year ago. Um, and First thing is, did they reread the paragraph? So they did. I chose my topic by watching a video about vision and it really caught my eye. I was interested in it because I wondered why some people have powerful lenses and some have weak. My original topic was animals, but I decided not to do because I wanted to learn about vision. I had so many ideas in my head, first thought of something. My topic interested me because I see so much people wear glasses and I wonder why they need them. I have my self but some people need to see i'm trying to find out why people need glasses for random reasons and how people get blind and how does it affect people from seeing so now i've reread it okay did i use capital letters at the start of a sentence so let's see here do you use capital letters at the start of a sentence um Yeah, well, mostly, not that there, right? So that should be a capital M. So we're going to fix that. We didn't have totally capital letters, but we've corrected it. Okay. Do I use periods or other punctuation at the end of my sentences? I chose my topic by watching a video about vision, and it really caught me at my eye. I was interested. In, uh, that should be a period, right? I was interested, oh, then that needs to be a capital. 
was interested in it because I wondered why some people have powerful lens and some have weak. Okay. My topic interests me because I see so many people wear glasses and I wonder why they have them. Okay, I think now there's periods here. So no to start, but corrected. Did I spell basic words correctly? Well, chose is wrong. Okay, I think the words are mainly spelled right now, so no, but correct it. Did I put two spaces after each period? This is a big thing. It makes it hard to see. This person has two spaces here, but here, look, you have to go after the period. It's spaced twice. Right? So no, but correct it. Do my sentences make sense? You can tell some of these don't. I chose my topic by watching a video about vision and it really caught my eye. Makes sense. I was interested in because I wondered why I was interested in vision because I wondered why some people have powerful lens is and some have weak. And that's the wrong weak. And some have weak eyes. Yep. So now I've, it didn't make sense, but I've corrected. And do I try to use paragraphs? This person does. They hit enter, they try to organize it for, for it, for us and make it clear. Okay. So basically you're using this checklist to try to make some changes to your thing. It doesn't have to be perfect. You don't have to catch everything, but you do need to try. If you bring it on Tuesday, and you have sentences without capital letters, you didn't try. If you have names without capital letters, you didn't try, okay? So this checklist is basically not, my piece is perfect, but it's, I tried to edit it. It's all I'm asking for. Bye-bye.